What's up guys, welcome back. Today we have the Bongo Ninja. So, uh, let's get through this first fight as always. We'll jump to the build, show you what we're working with. Um, by the way everybody, I got my gamer tag is uh, changed on Xbox One. It is now Games for Days 777. Um, so if any of you are on Xbox and would like to add me, that's what's gonna be. Again, Games for Days 777. What is this dude using? What is that? Is that the uh, follower saber? And that's because he got careless. Good game. Big huge damage. Alright, let's jump to the build. Alright, welcome back guys. So I've never used the uh, Drang Twin Hammers. That's what we're going to be using today in our Bongo Ninja build. Um, check out the stats. So we are level 120. We have 40 for Vigor, Tournaments at 10, 40 for Endurance, Vitality is at 20, 40 for Strength, Dex is at 34, 9 and 9 for Intelligence, Faith, Lux at 7. So, actually, hold on real quick. We're going to be using a Charcoal Pine Resin buff. That way we didn't have to put points into anything to achieve a buff. So we have the Refined Drang Hammers, plus 10. Buffed, we're hitting for 491. Pretty good damage for what you can do with them, as you saw in the first fight. Bless Cast is plus 10 for HP Regen. For Fashion Souls, we got the Shadow Mask, um, Black Hand Armor, Exile Gauntlets, and Iron Dragon Saiyan Leggings. We are the Bongo Ninja. I think it looks great. Um, we have Pontiff's Right Eye, boosting attacks. We have Cloyth Ring plus 3 for Stim. Wolf Ring plus 3 for Poise. And Ring of Favor plus 3 for HP Stamina, Max Equipment, Load. So, as you guys all know, R1 into the L2 into the R2 is freaking mega huge damage. You saw me basically just almost, well, we pretty much did one shot that guy, so it was nuts. But these things, man, can pack a wallop. Um, not too bad of a weapon at all. You can do a lot of mix-ups with these, man. And they hurt. Let's jump to the ring. Alright, guys. So, as always, if you end up enjoying today's video, support the channel. Leave a like before you go. I appreciate it. Let's do it. Let's go play these drums. Now, before anybody tells me bongos are played with your hands games, I know this, alright? But it just sounded great, the bongo ninja. I'm sorry. These fucking weapons always just make me think of fucking smacking drums. Boom! Big damage. I like doing that as well. So you see how you can L2, R2, right? With that R2, you get that jump, dude. You cover ground. Oh, we're getting messed up. Oh my god. But it's not hard. There it is. Good game to catch someone with the R1 and then leave them open to quite a bit of uh, choices. You know, because you do get the L1, uh, the dual-handed combo on these dude hurts. It uh, outputs quite a bit of damage. Um, so after your initial R1, you know, if you R1, L1, it's going to act like the second swing of that dual hand combo. We'll see if we can land some of that L1 majesty. Oh, not on this guy. I don't know. Super meta to build right here, boys. We should just parry him, but I'm not going to go that route. Gargoyle, a flame spear. And the, 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 you know, the disadvantage on these weapons, um... I would say is the reach. You know, you can get out space quite easily by a halberd. In my practice runs, man, I was going up against all these freaking halberds. God damn. We gotta get this guy. If we just catch him with an R1, he's gonna receive 800. There it is. Boom! That was the L2 into the R2, but if we can catch him with an R1, he'll receive mega damage. He's getting all excited. Oof. I was hoping he was going to run into it. Oh my god, this is too close. So again, it puts you in a bad situation fighting something with uh, some length on it like this guy. Oh my god, he just point blanked me with a bomb. How are we still alive? We got that HP regen with our Kestis. <clears throat> there it is. Oh my god. And it's over. I can't believe we just took that, man. Good game. Holy crap. The Bongo Ninja, man, lives on. Holy crap, I thought we were going to die for sure. I cannot believe we just took that match. Alright, what are we going to go against here? Is that Dark Moon? Dark Moon Blade buff? And uh, what is that, a straight sword? Yes, it is. Oh, and it's laggy as shit on top of that. Laggy as all hell. No, uh, maybe it's getting a little better now. I feel like my hits should have connected, but it didn't. Oh, we went for the parry. Can't parry that, so uh, unparryable, by the way. The uh, weapon art. 
At least the beginning of it is, as you just saw. Good game, man. Beat him up! Like a bongo drum. Oh, what the hell? This guy's coming in. What is he using? Uh-oh, we got Gales here. Oh, boy. This is gonna be fun. I'm gonna... Oh, what am I doing? I'm gonna get a taste of my own medicine. See if this guy knows about the uh, three piece of life. I mean, if you're using that weapon. Yeah, there it is. And it hurts. And it hurts, but it still looks so good. I don't even mind receiving it. Come here, bitch. Oh, we gotta do it again. Oh, I caught him with that. Nice, big damage. Oh, what is this? What is this all about? This guy. Uh-oh, uh-oh. And... Not sure what happened. That guy uh, took us down. Not sure what happened to the clip, guys. Sorry about that. Very strange. Anyways, back to it. Back to it. This guy's name is John, using Freed Scythe here. Fancy some gem. Come on. Not right now. Come here. Big damage. That was like 8 to 900, I believe. Man, it's over. Good game, man. Yeah, I'm not sure what happened at the end of that clip, though, man. That guy, uh... <clears throat> he took us down. I don't know why the hell, uh... Like, the last five seconds of it, um... Disappeared. Some, some funny shit can happen sometimes, guys, when you're rendering and you're editing uh, videos and stuff. Um... You know, if I'd love to be like, oh, it goes great every time, you know, and no problems, but some real weird shit happens sometimes. So, again, my apologies for that, but, uh, weird. Anyways, look, it's John again. The hitboxes get real fucked up on this roof, because, like, you're fighting on the incline. He really wants to hit me with that ice! That was cool, kind of just ran by each other, slashing at the same time. There it is! Oh my god, dude. It's such a beast combo. Good game. Again, man, these hammers aren't bad. You know, their their damage is pretty high, as you guys can see. Um, especially fighting at 120 with them. Um, you basically be able to one-shot quite a, f quite a few people. If someone's invading you, you'll be able to one-shot them probably no problem. Um, it's just, you know, getting your initial hits. What the fuck's this guy doing? Getting your initial hit in. And being able to, you know, spread out, spread your wings afterwards, after you get that initial R1. Uh, but on the reach, on the reach side of things, again, man, you can be outspaced and beat quite easily. Anyways. If someone knows what they're doing. I mean, everybody's fucking different, you know. There it is. Ooh, stop that weapon art, but he still got it. I don't know if you realize that, at least on our, our side of things. Looks like you got the uh, weapon buff. There it is. Good game, Ed. Take down the Lido's. Bongo Ninja can't be stopped. He runs from rooftop to rooftop, hitting all the bongo drums in the world. Oh shit, what do we got here? What is that? I'm gonna say, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, assume that's a Black Knight sword, is it? Yeah, that's a great sword. Black Knight great sword? Sure is! Uh-oh. What am I doing? What am I doing? Get out of there. Alright. Perseverance has been activated. Again, you're fighting this weapon, guys. Perseverance gets activated. You want to get the fuck away from it. Run. Run like your life depends on it. Eh. Oh. <laughs> Tried to bash him with the fucking hammer. Boom. Dude, these things would hurt. You know, it's pretty... It's pretty beast shit. Just smashing people with the hammers. And they're on fire. So the reason why I went with a uh, item buff... Is that way we could just put, you know, as many points as possible into our attack rating. You know, having them be, uh, refined. You get B scaling of both. But I didn't, again, I didn't want to have to sacrifice points to be able to get a buff, uh, you know, from whatever it may have been, so. And that's gonna do it. Good game. That combo, dude. Jesus Christ, that combo. Oh, 
I literally never see anybody using these weapons. The Drain Twin Hammers. I, I don't know about you guys, but I do not ever see these things. Um, I don't think I've ever fought anybody using this, actually, thinking about it now. Maybe one person I can ever think of or remember. We got the Immolation Jitter here. Not so many people using that either. Look at that, 900 damage, dude, for landing an R1. I mean, granted, yeah, you gotta do the combo after the other one, but obviously it's not fucking hard. It's two button presses. Crazy damage, dude. Anytime someone slips up and fucking eats an R1 from this weapon, dude, they're, they're in for it. Crazy damage. No what weapon I want to do next is the uh, Wing Knight Hellbird, I think. Oh, shit. I know you guys were uh, also, you know, he commented a couple of you wanting to see more unorthodox type shit. I've never used these. Again, I've never seen anybody really use them, so I figured they'd be a good weapon to make a build with. I think the Bongo Ninja came out uh, satisfactory. Dude, this guy. Yes, got him. Good game. Ha <laughs> ha. Bongo Ninja! No one's gonna believe that guy when he tells his story. I was killed by a Bongo Ninja. Wait, 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 what do you mean? He was a ninja? But he liked the fucking drum? Yeah, yeah, that's right. Oh, John's back! What are you doing, John? That was a sick entrance, so I like that. He threw up the, uh... You guys saw that? He threw up the ice wall and came jumping through it. That was pretty badass. I like that entrance, man. He's gonna do it again? Without the ice this time? He knows what's coming. And here it is. Good night. Look at my health. I swear to God, I did have a health bar. And it's over. Good game. All right, guys. We'll see you on the next one. This has been the Bongo Ninja. Enjoy the night. Peace out.